We're at the lemur area. We got two cute girls here today. Hello, Zoe. <laughs> Hello, you see? What animal is this? Lemur. Lemur. They look fluffy and cute. They got very long tails, haven't they? Yeah, let's move and move it. What color are they, Zoe? What color? Uh -huh. yes. yes, black and white and a bit red. Their eyes are orange, wow. Black and white Russell the lemur. That's different than the one before. They're yeah, a bit bigger and a lot quicker. Resting there. It is winter, so it's normal for them wait, to wait. rest. It's at the corner on top of the rock. Can you see it, Zoe? No. You need to stand up to be higher to see it. Oh check, my goodness! Check on the top of the rock. Here. No, rock. No, 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 the best show her. That means right. Oh, that's a snake. Yes, that's a snake. Yeah. Moving. Swimming. Listen. Look, it's moving. Yes, yeah. yeah, you can see under the water. Oh, I can see him. Look at someone else now. Why is the water super deep? Oh, he's going Look. up. Look! Nice. Where's the hippo? I didn't know hippos have the tail. He's eating. And the lizard was... I lizard? Oh, the lizard is going towards hippo. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't know hippo had tail. You didn't know hippo has tail. Now you know. Does hippo has tail? And is hippo small or big? Um, ginormous. Ginormous. Oh, that's a beautiful word. Ginormous. What is he doing? He's sleeping. He's sleeping. A yeah. sleeping monkey. Oh, he's moved to his head. <laughs> uh, his arms super long. You see how long his arms are? Oh. He's looking up. <laughs> okay, we'll move to the side so both of you can. You think he's cold? He has to be warm. He got some water in the eyes. He got some water in the eyes. This one's eating. Wow, look how fast he is. Look at his He's like he's little. He's so quick. Uh -huh. This is cotton on oh. On the top. He's on the top. Here you go. He's there. Uh -huh. They go very fast. They're speedy spreader. Uh huh. Oh, they look so cute. Are they cute? See that one there? They are too cute. I don't want to leave them. Oh, they're too cute. They want to be oh, very fast to see. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, yes. It's hard to see because of the net. You found it first. Good job, Zoe. Yeah. These are called a black and a white uh, color bonds. Mommy, you are white. Am I white here? Here you go. So it's this one. Black and white color bonds. This one's on the top. And camera camera. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them hanging there. They might be having a view. You can have a better view, see if you're up high. Uh -huh. We're riding an elephant, are we? Oh, 
Vroom, vroom, vroom. <laughs> kachi, kachi, kachi. Okay, let's go to see some real elephant, okay? Sea otters. What do they do? Do they lay on mommy's tummy in the swim? Because oh, they have a mommy. Oh, how can that many babies sit on mommy? Oh no. Each mommy carry their own baby. Hot chips and the nuggets near the elephant show, right? That's the giant elephant statue behind us while waiting for the elephant show. Uh, a cute green burger. A green burger? I know, my favorite color, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, he grabbed a lot. This elephant put a feet up. Maybe he will have some nails down. <laughs> oh, another feet. He listens very well, doesn't he? Now he's turning around. And Isabel found something new today. She said elephant has hair. Is that right? Oh, they're showing us their teeth. Now elephants are born with a lot of teeth. Very, very good in terms of the fact that elephant they need has to lots eat of teeth every day. So elephants actually have four teeth inside of their mouth at any given time. Four teeth inside of the mouth. But if they do lose one of those teeth, what will actually happen is one of the extra sets of teeth will move oh, down Oh, look at their trunk, Isabel. Like so they will end up with those four teeth oh, back in their mouth. <laughs> they, they, they don't stop. They don't stop from the teeth. They don't stop from the teeth. They don't stop from the teeth. Per day. So and depending on size, they have no fingers. The trunk they use trunk as their hand, right? And the ear. Is elephant ear big? Like a big, wow, well, big, big fan. Why do they have, why do they have dots? They have what? Why do they have dots on it? Oh, it's like your skin sometimes has a bumps and a dots, right? Wow. Oh, what is he showing us now? Another ear, maybe? Imagine if that's something that's very common that happens with bull elephants, and we should go to the quite often. He's actually pretty lucky that he has the uh, veterinary care here at the zoo that he does to make sure that they didn't turn into a uh, nasty infection that it was. So if you are interested in looking at how. See how he picked up this food. Ooh! Yeah, he goes. Almost looks like they're standing on their tippy toes. That does. Butterfly. So many different types. So pretty. Yeah. So pretty. took off the jacket. Oh, Zoe is going to hear the best take care of Zoe's jacket. I had a butterfly on my shoulder. I always get attracted by the butterfly. Every time I come, I got butterfly, right? I did it. Yeah, there's so many. The yellow ones, the blue ones. Oh, 
is what my finger is about. <laughs> oh, there was one just on my finger and that flew away now. I told. Yeah, it did tickle. There's a butterfly on top of another butterfly, though, on the top of the orange pile. Do you see that, you see? Yeah. Oh, they flew away together. Right? It's there. It's there. There's two butterflies on top together. <laughs> You like the green one the most? Me too. This one the leaf as well. Do I have a butterfly on my head? It's still there? I feel like it's actually gonna flood away. Yeah? Oh, there's one you another one. Oh, look! Look! Look on Daddy! On Daddy! Oh, on Daddy's camera. Daddy's filming ca butterfly on my head. I'm filming butterfly on his hand. <laughs> oh, butterfly! It's okay. <laughs> it's all right. Do I have a butterfly on my head? Yeah, it's still there. It's still there. <laughs> I feel like it's actually gonna fly away. Yeah. Oh, one you. Oh my God! On my oh, hand. Look! 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 <laughs> Daddy. The elephant. Look at a, a pond. Yeah, they love pond. They love muddy ponds. Not just pond. The muddy pond, right? They love to play here. They won't go anywhere. We can't go in it. They can, right? The Alice for the elephants. Uh, this elephant. I got a nose. I got a yellow. Elephant. Oh, yellow. I got a yellow one. Oh, hello. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. Wow. Oh my gosh, who wants to eat the elephant? The snake? The snake wants to eat the elephant, Zoe. Oh, that's not a friendly snake, that's a cheeky snake. Oh, she wants to go inside. <laughs> <laughs> she just said poo. Well, he's going backwards. Is he practicing walking backwards, you think? <laughs> <laughs> He's finding food. There's another one here on the tree. Oh. There you go. One on the floor here and one on the tree there. Oh, there's another one on the tree. So there are three of them. There's another one on the tree on the back. There's four with the fourth one. I have seen three. Oh, there's another one down there next to the log. Ah. Wow. This is the elephant scout, isn't it? It's weighs 57 kilos. We spot him, right? Yes, Papa, you what do you want to tell me? Oh, how pretty! Why? Why do you think it's pretty? Oh, because I love the color. Oh, and it's the tail. It's so long. It's hanging down, right? Go yeah, all gonna, the way it's, down. It's almost gonna touch the water. Yeah, and look at this one here. Where? Oh my goodness! You didn't realize there's another there one. another one? Yeah, there's two of them. If there's only one, they'll be too lonely. 
They need a two. She gives them a. You want her more? Uh huh. He's looking at us. He said, hello. Hello. Hello, lizard. We're trying to get him to turn up. Oh, oh, you got his interest. You got a snake. You got his interest. He's coming to check. <laughs> oh, oh, he's coming. He's like, what have you got in your hand? Have you got food for me? I scare you. His tail is in the water now, yeah, yes. I got his interest. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're teasing him. <laughs> now you're teasing him. He's inside. Oh, he's living with the lizard. The three of them, they're all good friends. They're in one cage, right? <laughs> Yes, they are neighbors. Here, the neighbors? Yes. And there's a turtle. Wow. Another one swinging on the back. Oh, Come and have a look. Oh, oh see why you jumped down? One jumped down. Oh, he's going back. See? The one he's oh he's really playful. He's pulling. Yeah, he's pulling. This is called orectane. The other one is on the top is eating. Hi. This one's sleepy. Oh, here you go. He's showing his face. Oh, wow, wow. Isabel, look at his face. Look, no, no, no. Oh, eating. Well, I've got the best of you here. It's so big. It's so big. Isn't he big? It's so big. see the lions always checking the map okay? okay yes we're going there good job good reading and you soon has a map as well he's taking Isabel okay you lead us okay Zoe you good girl these two kids they're really fast the platypus can they ring swim really fast yeah to show platypus Going to the lion park. Oh my gosh, the three of you they're too fast, they can't catch a whisper. They're real, they're not pretend, they're real ones. <laughs> they don't move, they're very slow. You can go and touch it. You, you go next. Okay, here you go. Zoe, can you reach it? Yes, you got it, Zoe. You got it, Zoe. Here you go. Yes, you can reach it as well. Here you go. You touch the tortoise. Mommy, I can see an airplane. I touched the body. Did you touch the body? Yeah, it's. Did that feel different than the shell? And it's it's hot and it's bumpy. It's hot and bumpy. Oh, good job. See the. Do you but you want to feel the body? Is that feel different? It feels. Dry. It feels dry. It feels like a pretend one. It feels like a pretend one. <laughs> Smash up! I will shoot into the tree. The white pig? Oh, I got four. A lot of pigs. Uh -huh. Into pig that tree. tree. <laughs> there we go. <coughs> it's a colored passery. The lion is sunbathing. Yes, there. Oh, there's another one, Isabel. Here on the back. 
here, a top, top on the hill. <laughs> one here and one there. This is sea animals. Can you find the snake? This is the kissing, kissing gurami. What they here? Yes, but you found them in the water. You feel oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Yes, they are green tree frogs. Green tree frogs. Mantid, it's on the top, Isabel. He's upside down, hanging on the top. Giant mantid. I'll help you. Water fountain, crocodile. <laughs> now we can see the leopard where the tree and the rock joins. Do you sleep here? Everybody is sleeping. There you go, it's moving. Hard to see him now, but he is on the top. He's sit up now, right? You can see his tail still, but his body is behind the tree now. They're climbing up. This thing is there. Loyin, you're too small. Loyin, you're too little. You're the bell cat. Wow, so many kids. Okay. Yeah. Where to go? Round two. Now there are less kids. Mommy, eat and go. I'm going to go by myself. No, no, you stay here, Zoe, with yeah, me, so please. Ethan's yeah, mom is on the top. Mom, I can't wait for you. No, you have to wait for me, Zoe, please. Because you need to stay with me, yeah, my daughter is stay with me, please. Hello. If it's too high, you don't have to do it. You can try from the other side if you want to. Oh, you can let Ethan show you. Yeah, show me. Good job, Zoe. Can only go a little bit. Don't come on here. That's okay. Very strong. Very strong. Good job. The bell's really good. She's not giving up. She keeps trying. Okay, you see, you try now. Very good, Isabel. You did it. Isabel, you did it. You yeah, you can wobble down the bottom. That's okay, Zoe. Good job, Isabel. Oh, hello, you said. Good job, Isabel. You didn't give up and you are going higher than before. When, when I, when I, before I only get to here, when I'm more higher I could get. Mommy, my hair is really getting annoying. Well, you took off the hairband yourself. Mommy! Snow leopard! Snow leopard! <laughs> Snow leopard! <laughs> kitty cat, where's my Zoe kitty cat? My oh, Zoe kitty cat is on the back. <laughs> Hello, kitty cat. <laughs> oh, yeah.
your sister helping. Yeah, otherwise, though, you couldn't get up. Thank you, sister. You're very kind. Thank you. Thanks for that. We finally have seen a tiger. Is it staring at us? It's, it's having shine. There we go, tiger. He has toys. He's got toys. The Tasmanian devil. So do you see it? Tasmanian devil. Oh, it's ran away the other way. Yeah, you can see it. He's standing on the rock. Tasmanian devil. Good job, Zoe. The devil. Oh, look at him. He's closer to us now. I brushed my teeth. Are you brushing your teeth with lollipop? Good to see. see. <laughs> There you go. Can I have your coin? Pick a coin, please. That's one or two. I think a one. Do you have, it's a tail. Uh huh. Right? There you go. Here's a snake. Another one. The two staring at us. It's eyes are open. No, they are. I think a one is open. One is close. Yeah. He's blinking at you, giving a wink. <laughs> Is he giving you a wink? Uh -huh. A lot of people think they are sleeping. Uh -huh. but they How about this one? Sleeping or not sleeping? sleeping? It's sleeping? No, it's sleeping. Not sleeping. Maybe pretend to be sleep. Yeah. They're very good at pretending, right? Yeah, they're pretending. I saw the tortoise, but a lot smaller than the one we saw before. Oh, there's another one under the tree. Yeah. There are two of them. Iguana. Oh, that's a cute iguana. No, no, it's ginormous. It's ginormous. Yeah, this one on the tree moving. Yes, wow. Oh, the, yeah, there's a big one on the top. Yes, you are right. That's the Capit of Python. It's called a jungle cap. It's the file snake. Yeah. Yeah. It went to eat. The snake wants to eat me. What's daddy found? Does the snake want to eat you? But it can't. It's on the grass. Oh, inside the grass. It's inside the glass. Wow. We are a frog. <laughs> Uh -huh. That's okay. We share. Share, share, share. The little froggy here. The next to the water. Really good at a camouflage. A wow, one is under here. And one is there on the back. Oh yes, two. Yes, I can see now. I can see the one, two. Good job. Two tiny mini frogs. On the stick here and on the stick here. Wow, the giraffes. Three of them. How cute are they? Chang Jin Lu. The birds. That's a cute one resting here by himself or by herself. Another one here. Cleaning its feathers. And oh, this, this duck has very pretty blue beak. Right? Very pretty. The others are here. He is coming to this side. Very, very pretty blue beaks. I think uh, there's female and a male. See these white birds on the tree? The swans. Yeah, the black swans. We always bump into black swans. 
Yeah, we saw the Bradley Park and Edwards Lake Park. That's a better view of the Wombats. Kangaroos on top of here and more out to the back. Oh, there's a emails. Oh. The emails there. There you go, the kangaroos munching munching. Eating food. Huh? The email is also out of the back eating. Koalas! He's moving his tail. Oh, that's his leg or tail? What do you think? That's his leg, I think. Yeah, that's his leg. Oh, look at him. So pretty. Right. Can you see it? And he's so big as well. There's another one here. this zebra zebra are they no horses yeah they are here. Right here wow right here they look like giraffe mm -hmm. oh wow look at the stingray did you see it mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow, so fast. Wow, another seal. It's oh, coming back. Oh, here you go. Cowfish. Yeah. Cowfish. See, they use their tails to wrap around so they don't get swung away. Very pretty, aren't they? Look at the cute little penguins. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Swimming. There you go. Oh, a couple going under. There you go. Where has the orange one? Feeding the penguins here. Yeah. So you have a, a colony of little penguins. When I was growing up, they were called fairy penguins. They've had a rebrand. They are little penguins now. Uh, very, very gorgeous. And down to Australia, you might know the famous game colony in Phillip Island, I think. That's really done well in numbers in the past couple of years. I think they're up to, oh, is it 40,000 now? Little penguins? Yeah, they're pretty, sorry? Yeah, I think so too. 
I think I've got some massive numbers of little penguins. This is fantastic. Because these guys are in danger of um, lots of predators, not only in the ocean, in the waters, but also things like foxes. Big fan of these little penguins. They're beautiful. But these little special guys so are many of them. the smallest penguins in the whole world. That's right, Australia holds the title for littlest penguins anywhere. These guys are also very special because they're the only penguins in the whole world that are not black and white. <laughs> if they're not black and white, any guesses what colours they are? They're all in line. Yeah, Tim. Thank you. Oh, look. Mommy, come on, Mommy. Excuse me, Fred. Fred, it's much easier to see in the sunshine. They're very, very sparkly blue when they're um, sitting in the sun. But they, that is something very, very special about these little penguins. You can kind of see at the back there. They are white and blue, gorgeous. They've got about 10,000 interlocked members, all laid with beautiful little bodies. They have a, a secretion from their tail that they use to oil up their feathers to keep them nice and waterproof as well. And they actually have an inner layer of feathers that always stays warm. That's how these guys stop from getting hypothermic in the cold, cold waters, is that they've got the outer lovely waterproof layer of feathers and then an inner layer that they can track air between. And so that inner layer of feathers always stays nice and dry. So looking at them waddling on land, they're pretty funny, aren't they? They're not super coordinated. But the penguin model is hysterical. But you know where these guys are very, very graceful. That's under the water. So many, many, many years ago when birds evolved, some evolved to fly in the sky, as we know, and others evolved to fly underwater, and that would be our penguins. So the mechanisms they used to swim under the water are the same as the birds in the sky above us. They used to fly right past us as well. Now those beautiful colouring for those beautiful feathers that are blue and white as you just mentioned, that's called a colour block camouflage. And so it's actually pretty handy to us they look very, very obvious. But think about it this way. These little penguins are quite shallow divers. They don't go too deep in the water. They tend to hang out near the surface. That's from talking too much today. Excuse me. And so if you're a predator for underneath, like a shark or a seal or something that wants a penguin snack and you're swimming quite low underneath the water and you look up at the sky, that white of the penguin's belly is going to blend right in with that white of the sky above. And if you are a bird of prey, like a, an eagle or something, hello, and you are looking down for a penguin snack, well that lovely blue of their feathers is going to blend in with the blue of the water as well. So it actually is a pretty effective camouflage for these little guys. They are really shallow divers, oh, they're probably around about 60 metres, um, but they do spend a heck of a lot of the time in the water. In fact, they even sleep in the water. These guys can take little tiny micro naps, sure, just drift off and sleep for like three minutes at a time, just floating along, looking at their flies. We can see a lot of them shivering now. Can you see that? So that kind of, that little, ooh, that little kind of penguin shivering dance, and a couple of reasons they do that when it's pretty cold, and that's a way to pull up more of all their muscles. Also, I'm guessing because I, um, lovely keepers are feeding them right now. Can you see that? Now they're not fish. Have a look at the keeper. Keeper, can we see the size of that fish? Pretty big. Thank you. Look at that. Pretty big fish. <laughs> Thank you very much. In these tiny little penguin bodies. And so sometimes, uh, because they have, uh, oh, I forgot what they're called, but their tongues are quite kind of pointed to help keep, once they catch a fish, to help kind of hold on to it. And so that's quite a big fish in the body, so they need to roll, shimmy it all, all the way down in their gut so they can kind of digest it. So we also call that a little digestive dance. Look at your little discovery. Look at the more shimmying. Look at the more shimmying and shaking going, yes. Getting that fish into my tummy. <laughs> very, very cute. You might have seen a couple of friends of that. Has anyone spotted um, a little one with a penguin yet? Is Naj in there somewhere, Clippers? Where is he? I like to talk about him. <laughs> okay. If anyone wants a one way penguin. Oh, amazing. Oh, wake him up. Bring him out. <laughs> so we do have a little, um, uh, often people ask about it. It's got a penguin with one flipper, and he's a rescue penguin. So we actually have a team that operates out of Melbourne Zoo called the Marine Response Unit. Guys, they are the most incredible people. So they rescue a whole bunch of marine life. Yeah. So, yeah. the lions. Swimming so fast. Yeah, the the penguins. <laughs> so our marine response unit, as I was saying, incredible. We have more calls to them than ever during COVID, actually, because everyone had so much time off. They were walking along beaches, along riverbanks, and uh, unfortunately, they were seeing more and more uh, marine animals in trouble, like uh, her calling fishing wire, uh, birds who tore plastic. Uh, we had to work for some dolphins and for some uh, ill penguins, uh, pelicans, and yeah, all, all of the above. Uh, and so 
Harry Mellon should not forget Penguin. He was one of these rescues. I'm not sure how he wants to split up. Possibly through an attack like a predator, or possibly killing a fishy hire or something like that. And then the keys, unfortunately, we don't want to. Oh my god, it's on my oh, hand. No.